<clears throat> hey everybody, welcome back to Zach's MR Review Channel. Tonight we're coming back at you with another interesting ration. This particular one is our Jordanian 24 hour ration. It's blank otherwise, it just says 24 hour pack. But there is a little more information on that from Safari Man. Let's find what he wrote. He goes, this Jordanian MRE is from the manufacturer in Amman, Jordan, uh, who happens to be a good friend of his. He tells me that the only difference between this and the packaging of the actual military one is Arabic writing and the military crest for the Royal Jordanian Army. This, this particular special batch that was sent to him is identical, like I said, except for the writing on the box. And it, it, this contains English and English insert and instructions. This particular ration is made for the Royal Jordanian Defense Forces. But if they are deployed outside of the, their borders, they usually outsource their rations from other countries. Uh, this is actually, as you can see, is very small. And the reason for that is the Jordanian soldiers in the field, on top of this, receive fresh pita bread with their rations, so I guess they bring some level of field kitchen or something of that sort with them to make the pita bread. As well as they also receive fresh fruits. Um, he says that the tuna in this ration is caught in the Mediterranean and he says as far as he's concerned it's the best tuna he's ever had. So again we'll see if I agree with that. So far he was right on the South African ration, he said it was really good. I agree, it was really good. So that's the little information he gave me on that one. So without for further me yakking, let's get this opened up. Are you gonna and see what's it? in it. Oh yeah, good looking. Had it sitting right in front of me and I didn't even think of it. That's why you okay. keep me around. No, 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 that's why. This is one pound, 14 ounces, so just under two pounds. Wow. For a 24 hour ration is not bad. Right, baby Shmoo? And joining us on this particular video, because I usually do an announcement here, we got wife and baby Shmoo, baby Nora, right here, being cute as usual. And then off over this way, we got Sophia and we got Tiny Tay over there. I'm not going to be in the video. <laughs> so, let's see what we got in here. So, opening it up, we got what is our instruction sheets right here. So, method for heating meals, there's several ways to heat the meal, blah, blah, blah. You can read it if you want. That's it. We have a retort pouch, this particular one. <laughs> Something, the white bean. I don't know if it's just beans or what, but it says white beans. Doesn't even have a... Oh, wolf spoons. Yeah, it doesn't really say much else. Next up, we have white rice with chicken. And a retort pouch with a nice gusset. So. Then we have our tuna. Light light meat tuna chunks in oil. Mm. I don't like the oil, I like the water, but hopefully it's as good as he says, because I'm excited. Then this is our Looks like jam. Apricot jam. And this is honey to go with our pita bread that we ah! received from the field kitchen. And there's a little accessory pack here. That's all, like I said, not a whole lot. I'm excited for this honey. I like to taste the honey. I love honey. This is really packed full of honey, too. Yeah, I know. Get it opened up. Dump it out. Ooh, those spoons are nice and big and deep. Yep, we got three spoons. They're a little cheap, though, in terms of quality. We got three spoons. Nice napkins compared to some of the other uh, rations you get. Uh-oh. And that's you. We got two Lipton tea bags just loosely thrown in there. 
We got two salts, two peppers. And it looks like a buttload of sugar. A no lot. Coffee. No coffee. No drink. Two, four, six, eight, 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 eight sugars. And that appears to be it. I'm gonna take a quick look here. And luckily, and just so happens, it's not quite pita bread, but I actually have a pack of naan, which is an Indian bread. And, yep, thank God it's still good. So we'll use this in substitute for our pita. Thank God I like this naan bread with Indian food, it's awesome. I get it at our local Sam's Club. Not a sponsor or anything, just, that's where I get this from. <laughs> Really good. Well, I, will try I think at least. Mm -hmm. So, we're going to get this out under a tray and we'll be right back with you. Alright, and welcome back. So I got everything laid out here under the tray. As you, as you saw when I was unboxing, opening it up, there's no FRH or, or even fuel tabs or anything. So, I dug into my box of extra stuff and I had another extra FRH. So I'll use to give our main courses here a little heat up. So, before we do anything else, we'll get this warmed up. And let's see how it goes. Yeah, where are this one's at? Uh. Oh, it's, uh, you, it's out of the, made out of the UK. Uh, but I forget exactly which ration I got it out of. I think it was a UK ration. Do not take the swallow because I'm leaving it in toilet. Okay. The nice thing with this too is it has a piece of tape provided. A door. To seal it down. Because I think it's awesome. Uh, we'll fold it over, we'll seal it down. Mix our water around. Oh, make sure that heating on gets nice and wet. Can I hear it? Shh. I think it's not more. I can't really hear it too well. This is good enough. Oh, that's a big change. Better move it. So, okay, man. I think I hear some crackling, so we'll get this set aside and hopefully that'll, hopefully that'll take off nice. There it goes. And out of nowhere, it goes crazy. <laughs> that is going crazy. So while that's going crazy over there, next up we'll get our drinks. So, do you think that's okay? Wait, shh, Sophia, I'm trying to make a video, honey. We'll get our teas made. You know, this is a 24-hour ration. There's really only enough food here to make one meal in terms of a review so i'm just gonna do it that way and it goes right <laughs> yeah that was stupid of me what there we go that's a little smart anyway okay, we'll take some side. and we'll start taking a look at some of our other stuff here so we got honey and jam and according to his directions Hi. According to his directions, that's made for your pita bread, or like I said, in this case, I use a piece of naan, which is similar. And I love it. And I can't rave enough about naan. I love this stuff. I don't even have So, anyway, at least you have. I constantly have it here. There's our yeah. apricot jam. Smells nice and apricot y. So I go over here and grab a knife next. Since it doesn't come with one, we'll use one of our own here. Oof. I'm not sure this is good anymore. Based off its non spreadability, I'm going to say that's probably no longer good. No, it's apricot jam. Oh. 
Look at it. Yeah, it's uh, it's not an eaten order. I'll tell you that. Exactly. Next, we'll give this honey a look. I love honey. Honey is my favorite thing to eat. It's good, honey. That's it. And yeah, that's a bit crystallized. Pretty solid. I don't think that's any good either. His wife said it might need to get he heated up. I It smells a little funny to me, I don't know. Let's try it. I will. No, we'll rub a little on there and see what happens. Yeah. That? Yeah, it tastes a little funny to me. It's bad, it doesn't melt it. I don't know. No, oh, whatever. We'll leave, that, we'll leave that over there. Next, we'll check out our tuna here. <laughs> yeah. There you go, that was totally fine. And said I'm just not a big fan of the oil. Let me try this with you. Oh, my arms. Okay. Well, not terrible with the oil, just not my personal taste. Mm. Yes. Mm. They're mm. quite delicious. And quite flavorful. I will say, I think I'll agree with Safari Man on this one. A lot, lot better flavor than the stuff you usually get here in the U.S. Yeah, I think so. I like that, so I'll give that one a thumbs up. Zach, watch her for a minute. I know. Here, baby, you want a piece of you want a piece of bread? Shmoo. Shmoo, shmoo. You want a piece of man? You want a piece of bread? You can mush that up and eat it. Yeah, go ahead, baby, baby. Enjoy yourself. Did that was this towel I made. So, anyway, mm. move that off the side here a little. I want to try some. Isn't that better than? That's better than the American. Yeah, hold on, Sophie. I'll get you some. Yeah, that's for true. Because that uh, um. Trying to, but I'm also trying to make a video. Mm -hmm. Everyone seems to forget that. Mm -hmm. I want more. All right, just hold on. I'll give you some more when it's over. Because this is, it's harder because it has oils, so. So, get ready to pull our mains out of the heater here. Oh my goodness, this is like the best tuna I ever had. See? <laughs> so there you go, Safari Man, mm -hmm. if you're checking out this video. You were absolutely correct on the tuna. Now, now, now I'm going to, now I'm going to be wishing. I'm going to try any tuna. I'm getting you some tea. Now I'm going to be wishing I had this to use instead okay. of the other stuff. So I'll move that over here for right now. Good, good, good. It's an oil, Liam, so. Mm -hmm. oil down side. It's not in water, it's in oil. Mm. Oh, no. Alright, just hold on. That's the best tuna I ever had. See, the bad part now is this is going to ruin me on tuna. Mm-hmm. Yeah, me too. Now this is going to be all I want. <laughs> yeah. Oh my goodness. Oh my god, that was so good. Is there anything else? No. No, the jam was bad. Mm. Here. Like it's Honey's not in great shape like either. Expired bad? Yeah. Well, the, the honey could be. Um, it it tastes a little weird. There's one more bite. There we go. Can I have a bite? I'll give you one more bite. Why do you want it on bread? It's a little weirdo. There's a little more oil on it. Watch out. Okay, calm down, honey. Please, please, please. Here, just please. Put the one this one. So we'll break this up. I want to try because I never tried it. A little hot. Be careful. Get that there. And get our beans. Here. 
Get our beans out here first. Look at this. Got it upside down. Okay, it looks like it's in some kind of tomato sauce. That's beans? Yeah, white beans and it looks yeah, it's in some kind of tomato sauce. Yeah, that's exactly what it's in. What are you going outside for? Oh, no. Smells good. Matthew stopped out to look at the lights. A little more, and we'll check out our chicken and rice. Looks good. Smells good. There's that. Exactly, baby. Baby cuteness. Baby cuteness. One more bite. What happened? I almost just tripped because I'm focusing on stuff else. Should I give the baby a little taste? I yeah. try. You look at me like daddy, you better say yes. I don't know if you're gonna like it. There's some salt on this. This stuff almost always just needs some salt. Can I have one, please? No. Can I have one? No. Get the pepper. No. As the salt falls out instead of the pepper. pepper. Is that pepper? Yes, honey, no. that's what I just said. Is it spicy? No. It's just pepper. There you go. And that we'll try it out. Pepper spray. She's chewing it. Good, good girl. Okay. You like it? Got a little bit of each. No. You had, you had three, she had three. It's good. It's a good thing I put that salt and pepper on it. Otherwise, it'd be a bit bland. The salt and pepper on it's good. Mm. It's actually really good. It would probably make this even nicer too is if I had something citrusy, like a little lemon juice or something, or even a powdered lemon to put on there. It would make it really nice. We have lemon juice in the fridge. Oh, well, that includes it in the house. Oh, okay. right, we have the rules. <laughs> Very good. I'm just digging into this too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no fail. Is that? She could have her. She could take her own. <coughs> take a bite and give it and give her some. It's pretty good. <coughs> uh, I'll uh, just try the rice. Uh, maybe it wants more. <laughs> Exactly. Yeah, it was. I agree. I like that. So aside from that uh, jam being bad, I mean, the tuna's been good. The chicken and rice is really good. Isn't that really good? It's all right. It's a little dry. Well, of course. So we'll try a little... Of our white beans and tomato sauce here. What is my throat thing? I can't have to. Well, yeah, I know that. Yeah. Pretty good. I'm not a big white bean fan, but they're not bad. Not bad at all. All right, pass that around here. Yeah, tomato sauce is nice. Not not overpowering. What do you think? The beans about are well cooked. They're not hard at all. They're very soft. What do you think about mixing the beans with the rice and the chicken? Um, you probably could. That's certainly something you could do. No, no, just don't, don't do it yet, girls. But that'd probably be something good. And then you could even throw some of that on your pita bread. Kind of fold yeah. it up, make almost like a wrap. Yeah. To really fill you up nice that's, and good. That's what I was thinking. Right, baby cuteness? <laughs> God, you're adorable. Sometimes I just can't stand how cute you are. Some. Yeah, and you're dangerous too. You launch yourself forward, head first. I'm gonna just taste some of the sauce because I don't like beans. <laughs> ah, bless you, darling. The sauce is okay. That's what I said. It wasn't bad at all. Take a little sip of my tea and burn my mouth. What says you, Nora? This smells like, like standard it? Lipton tea. You like the sauce? 
Uh, mm, nice and hot. Just standard Lipton yellow label yeah. tea. Is there anything? Not great, not bad. Yeah, there's chicken and rice and some beans and beans. sauce. Beans. What's in the beans? So there you go for being a for being a for being a relatively small 24-hour ration. It's actually, you know what? It's good. I'm gonna give this one a thumbs up too. Pretty good. This sounds more better. Just better. Use proper English. I was eating that. So there you go. Seems like everyone else is enjoying it. So we're all off camera here digging in. And well, I put some salt and pepper on it. So anyway, so yeah, so a thumbs up from us here, and another another good ration from Safari Man One. So, so can thanks. I just have some of the tea? No, thanks again to him for oh, yeah. for uh, having this. And if the and if uh, that Safari Man way. guy ever gets his hand on any more of that tuna, he could send it. Yeah, up I don't know. Way. I don't know amazing. if you can get. I don't know if you can get just the tuna, but oh, if you can, if hit you me can, up. Let me know. Oh my God, but that uh, is the best canned tuna I've ever had in my life. But anyway, from all of us here at Zach's MR Review Channel, as always, stay safe out there. Everyone, use common sense. Let's work together, stick together, and everything will be nice and fine. But, uh, but anyway, so that's it. So as always, hit that subscribe button down below. Like, comment on the video. Excuse me. Spread the word to anybody who you might know might find this interesting or entertaining. Please feel free. Make sure you like us and follow us on Facebook. And besides that, that's all I got for you. So I'm going to start stop uh, gabbing at you. And from all of us here at the channel, thank you all so very much for watching. And that's right, baby. And we'll see you on the next Ration Review. Bye. Bye.